Okay. But the question is limit from zero to pi by four. All of this, uh, and the substitution is uh, this one plus theta and x has to be changed with the u. Okay. Now, first of all, I can easily write this here under u. Okay. And I'll wait a bit that what is going to happen with this cos square x. Imagine if you have to take out cos square from here, that is a lot of working. Okay. So we should first of all find the uh, du by dx. Okay. Now this gives us 3 secant square x. Now just see that this cos square x, when you move this up here, this can also be written as secant square x okay so this cos square x i have moved this to the numerator okay now we need the dx from here now the dx is going to be du over 3 secant square x and here you go this is going to be du over 3 secant square x so you must see that by just waiting for a moment we can get rid of this nasty, uh, I mean, terms over here, okay? So, now it's time to change the limits. Now, please show all this working on the right side of your page over here, okay? Now, when your um, x is 0, your u is going to be 1 plus 3 tan 0. What is tan 0? 0, okay? Zero. So, this u is going to be one so the lower limit over here is one now when your x is pi by four your u is going to be one plus three tan pi by four now if you people look at these limits these angles which are being used these are always pi by two pi by six pi by three pi by four so these typical angles they are used so you must try to learn their values by heart what is tan pi by 4? Uh, that is 1. Okay. So this becomes, uh, this, this u becomes 4. So this is going to be 4 over here. I can cancel the secant square with the secant square. Now this becomes a very little small chota sa q2 sa question is left over here. This is 1 over 3. Limit from 1 to 4. And this is under root u. Now some students after reaching this point they are confused with what to do next. No, this is just, just a P1 level of a question, okay? P1 ke level ka question rahe kya piche. So this is 1 over 3, and there will be a 2 coming from the integral. This is, sorry, 2 by 3. Half plus 1 is 3 by 2, so this will be, the reciprocal is going to be 2 by 3. So this is u raised to power 3 by 2, limit from 1 to 4. Yes, so we have 2 by 9, and this is 4 raised to power 3 by 2 minus 1 raised to power 3 by 2. So this is 2 by 9 into 8 minus 1, that is 7. Is that right? This is 1 whole 5 over 9 units. Any questions, Bacho? Okay, there is no question, I can stop this recording then.